with the prices of Chanel bags increasing at the blink of an eye. It seems the continuous price increases has no end in sight. With the price of the Chanel bag in a medium size reaching over £7,000, we are starting to wonder whether the price matches the quality, investment and experience into owning a Chanel bag. If you are looking to jumpstart your luxury collection, it's quite clear the Chanel classic flap may not be the way to go. Unless you have the money, of course. But we have a selection of seven luxury designer bags worth considering for making your start into your luxury collection. And altogether, they cost the price of one medium-sized Chanel classic flap. So let's take you through our selection. And at number one, we have the Fendi by the way bag in the small size. With prices starting at upwards of £1,190. The mini, which is also sometimes called the small, is the perfect size, big enough for daily use and transitioning into a lovely evening bag. The Fendi by the way bag has been a mainstay in the archive of classic and iconic Fendi bags since its debut in 2014. The Fendi by the way bag features a Boston bag type silhouette shape reminiscent of vintage doctor bags. The Fendi by the way bag is a classic and functional versatile bag with multi-purpose carrying options as it comes with short double top handles and an adjustable and detachable shoulder strap so that you can carry the Fendi by the way bag like a clutch or crossbody or even over the shoulder. The Fendi by the way bag opens up to a spacious canvas lined interior and two roomy compartments divided by a zippered interior pocket and an additional pocket it is also finished with either a palladium, gold or silver tone hardware. The Fendi by the way bag is typically offered in colour options of a black, turtle dove and honey coloured leather, but is now available in more colourways. The Fendi by the way bag commonly features two versions. One version is hot stamped with the signature Fendi Roma logo script and a customisable leather pendant attached, and the other version does not feature the large hot stamped Fendi Roma logo script but features a small Fendi Roma logo script at the top of the bag, very discreet and minimalistic. And now there are offerings of the Fendi double F monogram embossed all over the bag as another variation. The Fendi by the way bag is a fantastic bag for organizing yourself, a timeless and classic bag that is a staple in the Fendi handbag lineup, whether or not it is seen in the Fendi runway collection. With a beautiful and minimalistic aesthetic, the Fendi by the way bag is a simple and safe option and definitely one to consider for your luxury collection. And at number two, we have the Mulberry Bayswater bag in the original size, with prices starting at upwards of £1,095. The price of the zipped Bayswater starts at upwards of £1,050 for the Mini. Designed by Nicholas Knightley and debuted in 2003, the Bayswater bag is Mulberry's most famous piece and bestseller since making its debut nearly two decades ago. The Bayswater name is taken from an upmarket leafy district of London. The timeless bag is a crossbody between a Birkin and the English Doctor bag, but with its own distinctive style. The Bayswater is a practical and spacious bag, supple yet slightly structured, featuring a luxurious suede lining. The Mulberry Bayswater bag was originally released in an oak, chocolate and black leather option, but is now available in a plethora of colours, patterns and finishes including ostrich and croc embossed print leather. The Mulberry Bayswater bag has a classic flap with a signature postman mini lock closure mechanism. The Mulberry Bayswater bag also features long shoulder handles, metal feet and an adjustable side strap that gives you extra room. The Mulberry Bayswater bag opens up to a soft brush interior and has one main compartment, one internal zip pocket and two internal slip pockets, with the stamp of the Mulberry label on the inside of the bag. The Mulberry Bayswater bag adds an air of sophistication to any outfit and works especially well for professional women looking for a smart and practical accessory to accompany their smart tailored outfits. While the silhouette of the bag has remained the same over the years, successive creative directors have revamped and reiterated it through material and colour makeovers. However, through Johnny Coker's reworking of the Bayswater, there is now a sleeker and more chic compact version, which has come in the form of the zipped Bayswater. This version does away with the heavy metal hardware. The padlock fob and metal feet are gone and the postman lock plate is smaller. The distinctive tree logo has been replaced with an embossed gold lettering spelling out the Mulberry name instead. The Mulberry zipped Bayswater bag 
boasts a more structured silhouette and a reinforced lining interior and is strong enough to carry laptops and tablets without altering the shape of the bag. Coca also introduced fresh new colours alongside the classic burgundy and black colours with rich and deeper hues. The original Bayswater bag has a rounded silhouette and the zipped Bayswater bag has a more squared silhouette. The new zipped Bayswater bag also has extendable wings without having the chic luggage tag. The Mulberry Bayswater bag is one of the most desired British luxury bags, the ultimate carry-all for the fashion conscious. And at number three, we have the Chloe Saddle Small Bag with prices starting at upwards of £850 and the Chloe Saddle Medium Bag with prices starting at upwards of £1,190. The Chloe Marcy Saddle Bag was launched in 2009 under former creative director Hannah McGibbon. The Chloe Marcy Saddle Bag is a classic from the Chloe Fashion House. A fresh feminine bag with soft curved lines exuding a 70s bohemian chic allure. The Chloe Marcy Saddle Bag pays tribute to the Maison's equestrian roots with its rounded silhouette and equestrian inspired shape. With the Chloe Marcy Saddle flat shape in a horseshoe. The Chloe Marcy Saddle Bag features a single flat shoulder strap with buckle adjustments, perfect for wearing longer your shoulder or carrying as a crossbody. The Chloe Marcy Saddle Bag also features small elements of hardware in the gold o-ring that forms part of the closure and the tassel ends with hardware offered in a gold silver or brass tone hardware the chloe marcy saddle bag also features a drawstring fastening closure tassel dangling at the front flap the chloe marcy saddle bag opens up to a cotton lined interior one roomy compartment and a single slit pocket at the underside of the front flap in addition to a discreet pocket in the interior wall showcasing plenty of space for all your essentials the Chloe Marcy saddle bag features premium leather craftsmanship and decorative stitching as well as the embossed logo lettering detailing of the signature Chloe script engraved on the middle of the flap. The Chloe Marcy saddle bag is the ideal day companion, perfect as an everyday bag. The Chloe Marcy saddle bag is usually crafted in a thick grain casting leather and has been designed in many different variations throughout the seasons including variations in a sheep shirling trim. A nod to its popularity and demand. The Chloe Marcy saddle bag effortlessly evokes the brand's DNA, a minimalistic bag, easy to style, that will suit any outfit, a timeless classic from the Chloe fashion house. And at number 4 we have the Saint Laurent Sac de Jour Nano, with prices starting at upwards of £1,535. The Nano size is perfect for fashionistas that don't have much to carry. The Sac de Jour was debuted under creative director Edie Soleimani. In the Fall Winter 2014 collection, the name Sac de Jour translates into Bag of the Day and is the perfect everyday handbag. It is a signature handbag for the Saint Laurent fashion house and remains one of the most coveted and iconic styles. The Sac de Jour bag features a sturdy structured rectangular shape with double roll topped handles in addition to gusset accordion like sides which are also expandable in order to create more room in the compact but very well organised interior. The Sac de Jour also features a leather tag with a padlock feature. The Sac de Jour is a simple and understated bag that opens up to a nice contrasting suede lining which adds to the luxurious aesthetic and is divided into three compartments by a large zip closed compartment that runs down the middle of the bag in addition to the troves of useful pockets and zipper compartments. The Sac de Jour bag also has several pieces of metal hardware detailing including metal studs on the base for added protection, the snap closure, locks and zipper pulls that contain the Saint Laurent logo, offered in a gold or silver tone hardware. The Sac de Jour is a simple, sleek and sophisticated bag that can easily transform you from a day to evening event, no matter the occasion. The Sac de Jour bag is commonly crafted from premium 100% calfskin leather or other materials and some options come in a unique finish. The Sac de Jour is offered in textured leather grained and pebbled, which is a bit more scratch resistant, and options in smooth leather, soft and buttery leather, and also a crock embossed finish. The additions to offerings in suede with a smooth leather lining and top handles. The Sac de Jour bag also features multi-purpose carrying options, whereby you can switch between either the top handles or the optional detachable flat shoulder strap. The Saint Laurent Sac de Jour bag is a truly elegant and minimalistic bag that does not boast ostentatious labeling, but just a discreet Saint Laurent Paris logo printed in gold foil stamp on the main compartment under the handles. 
The Saint Laurent Sac de Jour is available in a variety of colours, whether in the traditional black or navy blue, grey, burgundy or beige. The Sac de Jour bag is an edgy, stylish, contemporary and effortlessly cool and is undoubtedly a timeless shape, a seasonless choice and a true classic. And at number five, we have the Givenchy Antigona Mini, with prices starting at upwards of £1,350. The Givenchy Antigona bag was launched in the winter 2010 collection, and it instantly took the world by storm. Released under the creative direction of Ricardo Tishi, the Givenchy Antigona bag is a perfect example of Givenchy's fashion-forward attitude and edgy flair. Tishi's artistic signature is traditionally a play on contrasting femininity with masculine silhouettes in both his accessories and clothing lines, and the Antigona perfectly encapsulates Tishi's love for the feminine-masculine contrast. The name Antigona was inspired by the powerful Greek mythology heroine, Antigone, who was Oedipus's daughter. Antigone means unbending and is significant of her strong, fiery, daring and defiant personality. Antigone endured despite the challenges and tragedies of her life. The Antigona bag perfectly combines the masculine and feminine, the masculine aspects of the traditional Boston bag with its hard, aggressive architectural geometric shape and trapezoidal-like boxy construction offset against the feminine, subtle curves and rounded edges of the Antigona, which adds a grace and elegance to the Antigona bag's aesthetic and appeal. The Givenchy Antigona bag features double roll-top handles, an exterior triangle, Givenchy patch with the Givenchy logo embossed on it, and a zipper closure mechanism. The Givenchy Antigona bag opens up to a spacious and roomy main compartment, two interior flat pockets and one zippered pocket, perfect for holding all your essentials throughout the day. The Givenchy Antigona bag now comes with an additional removable shoulder strap, making the Antigona a versatile bag, allowing you to carry it in several different ways. The Givenchy Antigona bag is commonly crafted and offered in the classic leathers, which are the smooth calf skin or grained goat skin. But Givenchy has also released seasonal leathers and rubberized canvas and nubuck suede. In times past, the Antigona has been offered in exotic leathers as well, including ostrich and crocodile skins, on special requests depending on the season. The Givenchy Antigona bag is the perfect accessory that can transition you from day to night, perfect for a simple, understated street style look. The Givenchy Antigona bag is a robust, sleek and timeless classic. Not just a statement piece, it is an ultra stylish bag and an investment bag that will see you through for years. And at number 6 we have the Louis Vuitton Speedy in the 25 with prices starting at upwards of £1,030 and the Louis Vuitton Speedy 30 with prices starting at upwards of £1,080. The Speedy 25 is a very popular size due to it being practical but not oversized. The Speedy 30 is also a compact handbag and a good as an everyday size and remains the most popular size perfect for all your larger essential items. The Speedy got a small transformation with the introduction of a long shoulder strap with the Speedy Bandelier. Bandelier meaning with a strap in French. This variation is perfect for the modern woman needing a bag offering hands-free usage. In the Speedy Bandelier option, the Speedy starts from upwards of 1,270 for the 25 size, upwards of 1,310 pound for the 30 size. Rich in history, the Speedy is one of the very first handbags from Louis Vuitton. When introduced, the Speedy was an instant success, but before the Speedy came into existence, its precursor was the Keeple. George Vuitton invented the signature Keeple as the perfect travel companion, as an overnight weekend bag. The Keeple model was so popular that soon after, a smaller version was released named the Express. The Express was a pure travel accessory designed for a more personal effect so that travellers could keep their essentials very close to hand. The Express was adapted once again to meet the needs of busy women of the time. And with that, in 1932, the Express was renamed the Speedy. A year after its debut, Louis Vuitton reintroduced the Speedy in the monogram canvas. It can be argued that the Speedy didn't become the tireless iconic bag it is today until Audrey Hepburn was seen carrying one in the 1960s. Audrey Hepburn and her unique appeal put the Speedy on the very top of the fashion scene. The actress requested Louis Vuitton create a custom Speedy model that was smaller than the original 30. Louis Vuitton obliged and created the smaller version of the Louis Vuitton Speedy in the 25. When the Speedy 25 of Audrey Hepburn was introduced, the demand for the Speedy soared and its fate was sealed. The Speedy bag is one of the most unique Louis Vuitton bags 
that is made from one large piece of fabric from front to back when designed with the monogram canvas. As a result, there are no seams on the bottom of the bag and the back of the bag features the LV monogram logo upside down. The silhouette of the Louis Vuitton Speedy is inspired by the Boston bag, a slightly dome-shaped structured bag. The Louis Vuitton Speedy is commonly crafted in the sturdy monogram structured waterproof tear and scratch resistant canvas and also features a natural vachetta trim on the double Toron top handles and the pipers and tapers of the bag from the rectangular bottom. The vachetta lever being an untreated premium cowhide lever that will receive a full patina over time as it darkens with frequent usage. The Louis Vuitton Speedy bag opens up to an interior material made of canvas or microfiber with one large main compartment without dividers making the bag extremely versatile for different uses. Each Louis Vuitton Speedy bag is also adorned with brass hardware. The Louis Vuitton Speedy is also available in the Demier Ebene and the Demier Azur print and formerly was available in the Epi Lever. Over the years, the Speedy has become available in several more materials including the black and white multicolour and the monogram Empriant leather. The Louis Vuitton Speedy bag has endured the test of time and trends to remain one of the most iconic bags in fashion handbag history. And at number 7 we have the Saint Luan East West Shopping Tote. The prices of the Saint Luan East West Shopping Tote starts from £865. The Saint Luan East West Shopping Tote has a sleek, sophisticated, yet simple, simplistic exterior with no embellishments and no frills, bells and whistles, except a small, discreet, metallic text branding on the front that reads Saint Laurent. The Saint Laurent East West Shopping Tote bag is crafted from a durable, supple grained leather and features a single magnetic button top fast enclosure on the opening top bag. The Saint Laurent East West Shopping Tote is a practical bag with two top handles that allow you to carry the tote by hand or over the shoulder. The Saint Laurent Shopping Tote opens up to one spacious and roomy open compartment with an unlined interior and also features an additional removable zippered pouch. The Saint Laurent East West Shopper Tote is adorned with a gold tone, metal, wire cell, monogram, charm tag, hanging from a detachable lanyard tag at the handle base, giving the tote a slight touch of glamour and appeal. The Saint Laurent East West Shopper Tote is also available in a variety of single block monotone colours. The Saint Laurent East West Shopper Tote is a great option for those who love a simple everyday bag that can take you from the office to the shops or even use as a travel flight carry-all bag. There is also a tall version of the East West Shopper Tote called the Toy Shopper, also nicknamed the North South Shopper Tote, which also has a classic timeless look but is offered with a detachable and an adjustable buckle shoulder strap for more versatility also with the detachable matching zippered pouch. The Saint Laurent East West Shopper is a popular and celebrated tote, a polished everyday staple that will pair well with a variety of looks, simple and minimalistic with premium exquisite craftsmanship.